This knife is called the US, uh, the 2023 US Tonto. Uh, this is by Shed Knives. Shed Knives was nice enough to send this knife along to me to review and to check out. And I'm really excited. Uh, the gentleman that runs this company is a young man, 18 years old. This is his, his knife, his business. And he's got some really cool designs. Uh, it's built like a tank, the proverbial tank. And uh, we're gonna check it out because my daughter is doing here. This is uh, this is grocery store wood, kiln dried wood, um, and I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, do a little bit of batoning with this knife because my daughter's got a project for school where she's got to make some charcoal, make a charcoal filter. So to make the charcoal, we need to burn some wood, obviously. So I'm going to see how this thing performs in batoning because it is small, but it is stout. Oh, nice. All right. That was quick. Yeah, well, let's go down the center, see how it works. Now, mind you, this is that nasty kiln dried wood you get outside the grocery store. Nice. Let me see. Pretty different. pretty cool knife. Now, I like this G10 handle. Uh, this is all hand done, but I know that they're going to start CNCing their handles. I do look forward to checking that out. I like this protruding uh, bit of tang here. I'm not usually one to like that, but I like it. Like, it's very solid, very stout. Oh, look at that. See, I just broke a piece of this off. All right. Well, anyway, let's see here. Gonna see if I can blast through this one. It's a little piece. Very nice. Let's look at this. So this has a pretty short grind and I'm pretty sure it's flat though. Sometimes that can be deceiving if it's, if it's a hollow on a really big um, wheel. It's very, very sharp. And just putting it through a couple of pieces of wood, it's still super sharp. Let me do one more, and then we gotta get to burning. What do you say, sweetie? Mm -hmm. Man, that's nice. This has really got great geometry for this sort of purpose, wedging it through. Whoops. Thanks, baby. As you can tell, it... and this is a this is a relatively small. That's a three-inch cutting edge, and about three and a half inches to the handle, and it's really handling this task really well. You know, of course, you can't span a giant log with it, but that's obviously due to the size. But. As soon as I unboxed this shed knife, well, I didn't, I didn't officially unbox it, but I opened it out of the box. I said, I can't wait to take this outside. This is a knife that's screaming for this kind of chore. Let's see, one more. All right. Shed knives, the 2023 US Tonto. I really dig it. It's like a reverse Tonto. And I'm gonna jam this into the log for a dramatic final shot.